The pressure is on, and opening game nerves can often take hold. Match day one for these two nations here at the 2024 UEFA European Championship. Who will be first to make their mark on the group? Stay with us on EA TV. Hello and welcome, and I can tell you it was a dry walk to the gantry today. No rain in sight. I'm Derek Ray in the commentary position, and alongside me is the former Arsenal and West Ham midfield player Stuart Robson. And it's match day one in the 2024 UEFA European Championship. It's Turkey up against Portugal. Well, these teams know they cannot afford to drop points today. It's so important they're consistent throughout the group stages if they want to progress further in the tournament. Should be tense, Derek. And here's the lineup for Turkey. Well, in this shape, their two holding midfield players will be key today. If they can get on the ball and dictate the play, protect the two centre backs, it will then allow the attacking players to show their creative quality. Here's how it looks for Portugal. Bruno Fernandes plays alongside Vitor Pereira in central midfield and leading the opportunity to go ahead. Four marks to the keeper. Well, what a reaction from the goalkeeper. Such a good save in the end. Who can they pick out? High-class defending right on the goal line. Just knocked it out of there. Pressing really high. Well, I'm not sure about you, Stuart, but I always think it's fascinating to dissect Portugal ahead of a big international tournament. Euro winners, Ronaldo! And in! Oh, yes! Exactly what they were hoping to produce. They've delivered the goal. Well, I have to say, this is a really good goal. Just look how well balanced he is. He knows he's going to be under pressure, but he shows great composure to hit the target. One nil then. Chalanolu. Ruben Dias. Nuno Mendes Ferreira and Palinha with it and Bernardo Silva has it and it's teed up for Ronaldo they've only gone and grabbed another one two goals in quick succession now they have the lead no wonder they're celebrating Well, let's look at this again. The one and two touch passing is absolutely outstanding to play around the pressure. And this is Ronaldo at his best. He's composed, he shows great technique, and he just smashes it beyond the keeper. Two nil now, and back underway. Kukchu. Yilmaz, it's with Chalanolu, you can sense the threat is there. What can he do with it now? Ferdi Kadioglu makes the move to the inside. Can he take advantage? A goal! Just what they needed, still plenty of life in this match. Well, here we can see it again, and he does so well to skip beyond the defender. It just buys him that bit of time to get his shot away. That's a really nice goal. Well, as they kick off again, 2-1 the current state of affairs. Joao Cancelo. On the ball, Ruben Dias. Realising that it might be opening up on the opposite flank. Bruno Fernandes has it. Well-timed tackle. Fabdacci. It's with Chalanolu. Irfan Can Cavici. 
Good movement. Well, didn't go to plan in the end. Ferreira. That's useful play. Kukchu. A foul, but advantage played. Well, the fans want to see a shot. Can they square the game? Fine goalkeeping to push that away. Chanadolu. Yilmaz. That's really good and effective physical play. Well, that's a foul, and it sets up a free kick in a dangerous position. A chance then for the respective managers to address their charges. It is half time here. Well, no doubt about it, Stuart. Cristiano Ronaldo in the first half deserving all the superlatives going. Well, it's been an incredible performance from him. Clearly, the difference between the two sides. Obviously, the goals, but his movement too. He's causing the back line all sorts of headaches. He'll no doubt be desperate to grab the hat trick now. Second half underway then. Portugal have the lead, but it's a long way from being settled. and Cristiano Ronaldo waiting can he apply the finish oh great defending Cadioglu well, not giving him any breathing room Ferdi Cadioglu Yilmaz giving the ball away Ronaldo and he read it well intercepting it and in with a real chance well really fine goalkeeping good diving stop corner kick to Portugal as they go looking for more And there's the delivery. Clearance needed to be better. And well, they can't quite take advantage in the end. Chalanolu. Badacci. It's with Chalanolu. Yifan Chan Kavecchi. What can they do from here? Chalanolu. Open things up. This corner could be useful to them. Well, they've decided to make a change. Favoring the short one. And a free kick awarded by the referee. to the final 20 minutes Ronaldo a chance to whip it in 
rewarded for that brilliant high press. Great defending. It's a perfect challenge. Cenk Josu. It's with Celi. Irfan Jan Kaveci. Irfan Jan Kaveci. Arthur Kolu. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Mitch. Ferreira. Working so hard to win back possession. Giving it their all in search of an equaliser. And options in the centre. A corner kick, and who knows, this might represent the last chance to grab an equaliser. Substitution time it is here. Corner kick played in. No nonsense piece of defending. Silva. Oh, he's given us away. No foul play, says the referee. That's a good-looking ball. Well, adding up all the stoppages, we will have two extra minutes. whistle here a real sense of feel good in the Portuguese camp on the back of this victory Stuart well Derek they didn't dominate the game by any means today but overall they had the better of the chances and just about deserved their win well there's a reason why we're highlighting Cristiano Ronaldo he's been very creative out there Stuart well that was a great performance his understanding of how to find space was brilliant today and of course he scored two really good goals